So at first I'm priming my eyelid with a concealer and setting it with powder. Then I'm applying some loose powder to prevent any fallout since I already did my base. Then I'm taking this brownish shadow from Morphe 35F palette and it will be my transition color. Then from my Sleek Celestial palette, I am taking this matte navy blue shadow and applying on the outer and inner corner of eyes. And these shadows are really intense so you need to be very careful when you apply. Then I'm darkening the color with matte wood from the Balm Meet Matte Nude palette. The key of this eye makeup is to blending the shadows very smoothly. Now I am taking L7 blue liner pen and applying on my lower waterline and then on the center area which I left empty and will be blending the shadows with a synthetic brush. And on the blue liner, I'm applying Chi or Chai, the royal blue shadow from the Juvia's Plus the Masquerade palette. And to pop up the blue color more, I'm applying the color called Dahlia. And with the same brush, I'm making sure there is no harsh lines. After a last blending, I'm highlighting my brow bone with a shimmery shadow. And with this look, I'm not doing any wing liner. Thank you. 
Now I'm smudging the lower lash line with the same shadows. So that's the finished eye look. Now face, I'm going with light contouring. And to know the products, don't forget to check the description box. As blush, I took the Sigma blush shade Cora de Rosa. And if you are wondering about my earring, then it's from Trinket C, and I will give the link down below. As highlighter, I took Wet and Wild Precious Petal, and this is one of my most favorite highlighter from drugstore. And I'm applying the lipstick Isabella Dupont Velvet Matte Lipstick uh, in the shade 603 but I didn't like the color with this look so I took the shade 602 and darkened up the shade a little bit more. So this is the look pretty much and I hope you guys liked it and tried this look out. So till then take care and advance it Mubarak.